Lots of people are thinking of swapping their non-steel proof shotguns for a modern gun that can shoot steel. So what do you buy for under £2,000? I ask Ian Hodge, who runs the fabulous Ian Hodge Field Sports near Wade Bridge in Cornwall. A lot of people are coming in quite concerned uh, that they're going to buy something or they've got something that they won't be able to use. So we are beginning to see the question asked, uh, you know, is this gun going to fire steel and can it fire steel? So we are uh, seeing a movement over to steel proof shotguns. We try to keep on the rack, whether it be air gun, rifle, shotgun, around 700. It goes very well and I like to have a big selection of guns for people. They're, they're going for the, 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 the favourites really still, the, the, the Beretta Silver Pigeon, the Browning 525. Beretta do, do a, a white onyx which is a, a silver pigeon but a little bit plainer. Uh, the Lincolns, some of them, we've still got a few Marocchis left going well. Uh, Benton Sollies to, to a smaller extent. Most people push for a Beretta Browning because they know the resale value is also good. They hold the value well. 80% of our sales is split between Browning and Beretta. This one is a, uh, it's, it's a Beretta. It's very similar to the Silver Pigeon. It's a Beretta White Onyx. But as you can see, it's, it's a little bit plainer there. It's just got the gold right in Beretta, but essentially it is a, a Silver Pigeon. This is a sporter version. Um, so it's got the wider rib ventilated barrels. Um, good all round gun um, and well under your £2,000 um, price tag. Uh, again, all our new Berettas we supply with a free of charge 10 year warranty. So you really can't go wrong. You can have that gun for 10 years and have nothing to worry about. The only trouble with White Onyx, Beretta only bring out so many a year. They're always limited in stock. They're not mass produced as such. So there's the Silver Pigeon. What can I say? It's probably the most popular price shotgun we sell with that, 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 that sub £2,000 mark. Everybody, well, most people come in and say, can I look at a silver pigeon? They don't always buy a silver pigeon, but they've heard it, they know about it, and they want to, to, to look at it. And fortunately, silver pigeons tend to fit most people as well. As long as, as, long as you're averagely built, we haven't got to do too much to, to get, get it to fit people. This is the field version. So automatic safety, um, narrow rib, uh, good all round gun, affordable, um, and it won't let you down. We, 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 can't, uh, we can't praise them enough really. 525, that, that action goes back to 1925 when it was the first mass produced over and under shotgun. A little bit more bulkier than the Silver Pigeon, so sometimes a, bit, a bigger chap may, may grab this one and like it because it is a bit more bulkier. Um, a, a little bit wider, but again, it's on par with the Silver Pigeon sales-wise. Um, again, do it, they do it in the, this is a field version, but they do it in the sporter version. A good all-round gun, you can't, you can't knock them. And again, 10-year warranty from us. It is peace of mind for people that, you know, they're spending that sort of money. It's a chunk of money for some people to spend, and it just gives them peace of mind then, that anything major goes wrong, that they're, they're covered. The, the Lincoln is probably our next most popular one. Um, Caesar Greeny is very popular, but just over the £2,000. Uh, Fab Arm, a little bit less, good, good money again, uh, very popular. I think sometimes our drawback is that we've got too many guns. Uh, I don't know whether other shops find the same. And then there's too much choice for people. Sometimes I think if we only had 10 guns, they would just, people, the customer would come and say, oh, I'll have that one. So um, it does take a long time sometimes to sell a gun to somebody because there's such a choice. I don't actually own uh, a new over and under, or an over and under. Uh, if, what I tend to do on, on our syndicate, I'll take a nice second hand one that's on the shelf. Um, and then it, it does get me the feel of a gun. I've not shot, uh, until last year, I hadn't shot a Caesar Greeny, uh, other than an odd time or two. So I took it out on our syndicate for a, a, few, uh, a few shoots and absolutely loved it. And, and then I can pass that back to the customer. Uh, but yeah, it, it really, all the modern guns are, are good. People come to Ian's shop from all over the UK. You can see Ian's guns on his website and on guntrader.co.uk or just drop in.